Alright guys, so welcome back to another additional video. I'm your co-host Isaiah Wagner and this involves the computer. It's not a serious matter, don't worry. Um, it's got three different cameras that I'm looking at. I'm planning on getting, I mentioned it that I'm planning on getting one, but we don't have enough money yet. But I'm, I'm saving up right now. I'm about halfway there for this one. This is the Canon Power Shot. And then there's a DSLR. And then there's a big camcorder. So let me know down in the comments which one you think. So let's start off the video. Alright guys, so here's the Canon Power Shot. It is the SX730. It's got it comes with a SD card with all these accessories. So I'm not really worried about the accessories. It's got quite a bit of them, so I'm not really worried about that. I'm worried about the camera. So let me know down in the comments which one you think I should get. So this is the first one. So let's go to the next one. Let's go up here. All right. So here is the next one. Let me see this for a second. So this is the Canon Vixia HF G21. So it's definitely an upgrade to what I've got. So it's a 20 times zoom. It's got like this right here, the horseshoe. If you're pointing at it, like right there, it's got the like, the horseshoe mount for like the mic. I had met to make my own uh, mic holder on this camera because it didn't come with that. So that's nice that Canon did that for this time. So it is a 20 times optical zoom. It is not near as good uh, as zoom on this one. I mean, the zoom isn't as powerful on this camera right here, but the camera I'm using right now has definitely a lot higher zoom range. So this is the, I have no really, I don't really know about this camera. It's definitely a little bit more spendy. So it's over twice the amount of the other camera. So I don't know about this one. This is kind of iffy. This is more like a professional uh, hunting camera. So this is won't be like this one right now will be my vlogging camera probably if I get this one. This will be my hunting camera. So let me know down in the comments. I really don't know. It's a really di tricky decision. I have no clue. Let me know down in the comments. So here's the next one. This is the Canon EOS Rebel SL2 digital SLR camera. It comes with a 16 gigabyte and a 32 gigabyte, and then it comes with all these different lenses. There's the long, bigger lens, there's a the smaller lens, and then these little wide angle zoom lenses, and then stuff like that. So it comes with a bunch of accessories. Ooh, shoot, let me try that and get that fixed. Okay, so this is the camera alone. So let's change it, and then see right here. See these little ridges right here. That means it's a flip screen. So this one also comes with a flip screen. So that's pretty nice. So. I like that Canon provides that in these cameras, so I'm super excited because <laughs> this one I'm actually thinking about, it's a little bit more spending than the first one, like I said, and it's definitely cheaper than the, the second one, so I'm kind of debating whether between this one and the first one, so let me know what you think. I don't really know about lenses very much, so if you know anything about lenses, let me know in the comments. This, I think it says... 75 to 300 millimeter or something like that. I don't really know what that means. Like, don't get me wrong. I have no clue what these mean. So, Canon zoom lens, 75, 300. It's pretty much the same thing. So, I don't really know about this too much. So, this is the Canon alone. So, that's the first, that's just the Canon alone without the lenses on or anything. Oh, sorry. Let's focus that. So there's one of the zoom lenses. Then it comes with these little chargers, so that's nice. And then it comes with all these different accessories. So it's kind of a hard decision. Nowadays, all the big YouTubers, they all have DSLRs, like the last one I showed you. But it's also kind of tricky to decide between this one, the DSLR, between the power shot one. So let me know down in the comments what you think. I don't know what I'm doing. I know a little bit about cameras. This one I have a lot of experience with. I've had it for since January. Yeah, the beginning of January. So I've had it a little bit over a month, almost two months now. So I'm having pretty uh, quite a bit of fun with this one. It's a pretty good hunting camera. I'll pretty uh, if I get the DSLR and the power shot one, this will definitely be my hunting camera unless the DSLR bigger lens works for like long distance. Then I'll be using the DSLR probably for like group hunts so like if I because like if you know anything about DSLRs you probably do but like you have to turn the lens to get to zoom in so I don't know how I'm gonna like that it seems like it'd be pretty cool to use it comes with a little tripod but don't get me wrong I know those I know those uh, 
tripods are junk so if you are looking for like a tripod like you're like oh it comes with a tripod mom don't even say that because those tripods trust me my brother got one of those and it broke within like I think 10 minutes of using it like the leg broke or something like that so do not get that so I'm thinking going with the DSLR or the PowerShot I don't know PowerShot one is kind of an easier one to get because of course like when you get that money you're like uh I don't know if I should get it so I'm kind of helping I need your guys help to let me know which one you think I should get I am having so much trouble deciding I asked my brother and he said uh, my brother Paul he's the one that made the first video on this one so he's uh, leaning more towards the DSLR so I am too it's kind of a hard decision of course it's 650 bucks so I could find a cheaper one probably but they don't get much cheaper than that if you want the flip screen and I really want the flip screen so if you guys find one let me know down in the comments if you find a cheaper one with a flip screen let me know because I'm really looking for one and the lenses cost like hundred and fifty dollars so the camera isn't too expensive but the lenses are pretty expensive so I don't really know where to find the lenses besides Amazon and when I looked at them they're pretty spendy so I was planning on just getting a, one with a small lens but I looked at this one and it came with the big big lens too and I don't have to spend 150 bucks for a, just a lens alone so let me know what you think I'll catch you all in the next one really appreciate the view Peace.